Lobby Tools, legislative news and information systems on the web at lobbytools.com. Whether you're cheering for the Florida Gators or you actually support Florida Gators, there's a plate for that. Florida offers drivers 120 specialty license plates ranging from the environment to the arts. There's a plate for Boy Scouts, but no Girl Scout plate. The ladies are good at selling cookies, but couldn't sell enough tags to stay on the list. If you don't keep up and don't have a thousand out on the road in a year, then you get put on probation. One year below a thousand and the plate is next. The Hispanic Achievers and the St. John's River Plate both started 2013 on probation. It's hard to, to get a, a startup plate going. By phone, I spoke with Mark Middlebrook with the St. John's River Alliance. 400 plates have been sold so far. Mark's confident he'll reach a thousand. The St. John's River has been kind of uh, overlooked as an environmental resource in Florida for, for many, many years. Specialty tags cost extra. The additional money goes to support the cause. So far, the St. John's Plate has raised $10,000 to protect the river and its tributaries. We checked in parking lots all over Tallahassee, but the two plates on probation were nowhere to be found. But we did find plenty Choose Life plates. Sheila Hopkins with the Florida Catholic Conference says it's always a top seller. It's been a strong plate in Florida, and uh, they have over the years. It's been in the top 10 uh, plates sold. Frustrated with the growing number of tags, state legislators passed a new law requiring groups to pre-sell 1,000 plates before manufacturing begins. Reporting in Tallahassee, I'm Whitney Ray.